Hello, ladies and gentlemen, welcome you to another episode of our show, The Little Foxes, where we borrow the verse written by Solomon the king. He said, Beware of the little foxes that might ruin the vine. Where uh, it's the idea of the little sins that we dismiss in our lives, but slowly and surely they will grow into much bigger and take over our lives. We have joining us today the wonderful His Grace Bishop Marcos, who's uh, agreed to give us a little bit of his time. We thank you, Sayyidina, for joining us. I am very happy to be with you. Yes. Thank you, Sayyidina. Today we want to discuss swearing, where um, quite a few of the youth, let's say, they, they start off with, uh, with swearing or little swear words that, you know, they it may be an expression of anger or disappointment, and they say it's okay as long as I stay small. Um, what are some of the dangers of that, Sayyid? Of course, that's where uh, the, uh, Jesus Christ said, nobody can go to the uh, kingdom if, I, if he has a swear or lie or something like that. Uh, but we always say that these mistakes or little foxes in our bottom just with talking with uh, some uh, loud voice maybe they uh, push us push us to uh, rise wh what we have in our bottom not from outside some people if you ask them oh you lie or swear or something like that uh, somebody he anger and push me to be anger and I no. This person who only open the treasure the what you have, inside. open your cabinet, and you will have anything inside will be outside just during the anger speaking or uh, or loud voice. Right. Not this person is a mistake. No, this mistake of myself. Because this I have in my bottom, in my heart. And just he push the button or open the door, then I have this uh, outside the, the, in my mouth. So you, the, the, you're just saying it comes out, whatever is in my heart, that's what comes out when I'm yes. angry. Now, what, which swear words are okay and which ones are not? Like which ones are like the, the ones that I can kind of use day to day? If my bottom full with the uh, Bible words, then even I have angry or something, a loud voice, I will take these verses and speak with verses with the Bible, which I have in bottom, it will be outside. Just with any, uh, any, uh, any problem or any problem, anger, yes, any, any anger things, any loud voice. Perfect. Now, what do, you, do your grace say to someone that says, you know what? I want, I'm going to swear, but just like the, the little swear words, not the big ones. And they think that that's okay. There is no small swear and big swear. The same as the lying. There is no white lying or black lying. The swear is swear. Perfect. And forbidden. Okay. So, Your Grace, some, let's say um, if, if someone resorts to swearing to express their anger or disappointment or, or their frustration, What's some advice that Your Grace can give us instead of swearing, what should we do? We should take care for all the words from our mouths. Because Jesus said that every word you will be, go to the uh, judge or to, to the count for uh, the eternal life. Then if I take care for every word from my mouth, of course the mouth means from my uh, uh, mind and from my heart. If the, if the uh, mind and heart full with good words, I always speak with good words. But if something inside or between these good words, something, always I will speak with lying or swearing or something like that. Perfect. Now, what, is, what are the dangers of allowing a little bit of swearing and small swearing in the big, in long term, Yanni, later on. Of course, of course, small swear, by time it will be big swear. I also, said I want to ask your grace, um, in, the, uh, in, the, in, in the Bible, the, the New Testament, our Lord himself, when he's speaking to the Pharisees, he says, you snakes, brood of vipers, which is not swearing, but it's definitely name calling. Does that kind of, is name calling, is that okay? No, because, uh, uh, our Lord Jesus Christ, he knows the person and he explained 
uh, what he has in that time. For example, if he said that you are serpent or snake, this means the way of this person, the same as the snake and the same as the serpent. Mm -hmm. Not... Uh, it's not out of anger, but it's, it's a description. Yes, description, yes. Thank you so much, uh, Sayyidna, episode today. Uh, awesome, again, no little, uh, no small swearing words or there's big ones. And we, and like Sayyidna said, we start out with some small swearing, we lose our credibility, and now we're unable to justify ourselves. We must be careful of the little foxes that can ruin the entire vine. Thank you all so much. We'll see you next time.